right, boys, we are back, and it's time to head into the year two playoffs with our Washington Capitals. And in the first round, we got a divisional opponent here, the Florida Panthers. And I must say, our record looks a lot better than theirs. They're 42 and, uh, what, 40? We're 51 and 31, all right? So, no excuses here, boys. We have a team that can get it done. Now, before we get started here, I had a request in the last video in the comments. Uh, basically, you guys wanted to see the lineups for the Calgary Flames because they made it into the playoffs and when I had the Calgary Flames I did a complete rebuild so here you go not too bad Barchese is still only 79 overall so he's getting better you know it's probably all uh, what's his name Kippersoff if he's still an elite goalie really not the greatest lines right there I mean dear, dear god Camilleri might not even be a first line well maybe at 85 he might be not really the greatest uh, lineup though defensively yeah, you know what? Yeah, they're pretty good defensively. I mean, look at that top four. Bo Meester, Weidman, Giordano, and Leopold. I mean, that's pretty good. And then the third line, Sarich and Babchuk, both defensive defensemen. And then put this guy in the net. You know what? He's only 85. You know what it probably was? Leland Irving. He probably got 20 wins. You know, he probably only got 20 starts, but he probably got 18 wins out of those 20 starts. All right, so there you go. Anyone who was asking to see the Calgary Flames lineup, there you go. But we don't have to worry about the Calgary Flames. We're in the Eastern Conference, all right? That's a ways away. we got to try and get to the third round for the first time in a while. I can't even remember the last time Washington made it to the third round. It was like back when they uh, faced Detroit in the final, I think. All right, so it's been a while. So here we go. Uh, the first line for the Florida Panthers. Ooh, look at Huberdo. Jonathan Huberdo. He, uh, he's gotten a lot better. 85 overall. That's pretty good. Uh, Mueller. Is that uh, Peter Mueller or Patrick Mueller? It's the Mueller guy from Colorado. He's still pretty good, though. I can't remember what his first name was. Uh, 85 overall. And then the right winger, Chris Versteeg, 82. So, you know what? That first line, it's actually not horrible because I'd say uh, Huberdo and Mueller are both first liners, right? 85 overall or just on the brink of being a first liner. So, it's actually not that bad. Second line, you got Thomas Fleischman, Stephen Weiss, and Ryan Klo. It's actually a pretty solid second line. You know, nothing too spectacular, but uh, they're all really good players. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, third line, Scotty Upshaw, uh, Matthias, and Sean Bergenheim. All right. Um, not the greatest third line. Not horrible. I'd say that they're listed as third liners. Uh, Upshaw and Bergenheim. Matthias is definitely... Matthias, or Matthias, or whatever you freaking pronounce it, he's probably a second liner. And you know what? That I actually do like that third line. Because look, the two wingers are two-way forwards and the center's a power forward. So defensively, you know what I mean? Really good defensive team here. And then the fourth line, Gotch... Uh, Wellman and Kopecky. That's actually a pretty good fourth line as well, just because it's pretty similar to the third line. And I'd say a lot of that fourth liners are uh, listed as third liners, all right? So you know what? They actually they don't have any of those superstars up front. Huberdo and Mueller are not bad, but they're not superstars. But they definitely have depth on this team. And they definitely have a lot of grit. I mean, look at those uh, all those two-way forwards, power forwards, all right? Hell yeah, this could be a tough team, actually. Defensively, you got Brian Campbell, 86, not bad. Kulikov, 85. All right, so their first line defensive core is pretty good in Campbell and Kulikov. Uh, second line, you got Ed Jovanovsky and Philippe Kuba. Uh, not bad. I'd say they're both listed as top fours. And then the third, Ellerby and Good Branson. All right, not great. Uh, well, not horrible, but not great either. Uh, you know, their first line is not too bad, actually. They're f and their first line power play is probably not going to be horrible either. Yeah, Huberdo, Mueller, and Weiss up front, then Campbell and Kulikov. All right, so these guys aren't bad, but who do they have in the net? Gee, yeah, here, here it ends for them right here, right? This is the exact reason why we should have no... Not no problem beating them because anything can happen, but no excuses. If we lose here, no excuses because look at their two goalies, a 79 and a 78, all right? There's no freaking excuse. I don't even know if they'd be listed as backups. Maybe they would. Yeah, they probably would be listed as backups, all right? But still, no excuse because you look at our team and we got the man, Braden Holtby, in the net, 83 overall, all right? Up front, I mean, look at our first line, Ovechkin, Datsuk, and freaking Backstrom, all right? Our second line is better than their first line. Our, uh, we, they got some they got some pretty similar depth to us because we have a, a 72 in there. But still, defensively, our first line is just a little bit better than their first line. We got the depth, all right? I mean, and we got the goalie. So, no excuse, Washington. This should be, again, anything can happen in the seven-game series. But still, this should be a walk in the park, all right? We got home ice advantage. We got the better team. Injuries are back on. All right, so let's go. And we let's try to avoid some injuries here, boys. I don't want to see, you know what? I don't, I'm not going to jinx myself. I'm just going to shut up. Here we go. Go. Game one at home. First period. All right, we start off with the goal. And look at that. It's the trade. It's the trade deadline defensive pickup. Mark Stewart on the third line. Good job. All right, keep keep going now. Second period. 
Right, oh, there it is. It's over. It's over. Gardner got one. Louis Erickson got one. And Mike Ribeiro got one. All right. It's over. There's no way Brayden Hopi allows uh, freaking... There's no way uh, Brayden Hopi allows four goals in a third period. And not against the Florida freaking Panthers. It's not happening, all right? He had a good end to the season. I think it was a 3 nothing victory. Ooh, Manny, Manny Malhotra pops in a goal. 5 to nothing. Come on, there you go. And our first game of the playoffs is a shutout. And look at that. We only had 23 shots on the net, but five goals. That's what's going to hurt uh, Florida, the uh, Florida Panthers, man. They don't have a goalie. They don't have a goalie. And I think they sent me a trade offer in the midseason. They were going to trade me uh, Jose Theodore. So, I mean... I would do it too. If Markstrom is already as good as Jose Theodore, I'd be wanting to, uh, what's it called? I'd be wanting to grow him as well. Yeah, so you see injuries are on. Ooh, already some big injuries already. James Van Riemsdyk, Marion Hosa. Damn. Poor teams, man. First game of the playoffs. <laughs> There's already been, look at this. Tomorutu, Cody Hodgson, Alex Tange, uh, James Van Riemsdyk, Marion Hosa. I mean, Jesus, man. Injuries everywhere. All right, well, it doesn't matter. We didn't get injured. All right, so let's keep it going here. Game two, home ice. Come on, boys. Let's not mess around here. We can beat these guys. Come on, let's not give them any chance here. Let's try to wrap this up as soon as possible so we don't have to worry about injuries. Come on. First period. All right, 0-0. Zero, zero. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Second period. All right, we got one. Pavel Datsuk. There you go. That's why I went out and got you, man. You got to produce for us in these playoffs. All right, traded away our franchise defenseman, Mike Green, for you. Come on now. You got to step it up. All right, here we go. Come on, Hopi. Third period, we need a support goal for him, though. There it is, Nikolai Kuhlman, of all people. All right, Cooley, I wasn't expecting you to have... Oh, there it is, Louis Erickson. All right, three-goal lead in the third... Oh, my God, four-goal lead. Jason Chimera. Poor uh, Markstrom now. Now Markstrom's in the net. Oh, Jonathan Huberto gets one. I was hoping that Hopi could get back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back shutouts, but didn't happen. That's all right, though. Don't worry about it, Hopi. Still an amazing game. 34 shots against. Only one goal, f uh, one goal for them. All right, so we're doing good. This is what I expected against this team. Uh, we, there's no there's no excuse why we shouldn't be able to score goals. All right, 79 overall goaltender. Uh, we were like fourth or fifth in the league for goals for. Nah, nah, nah. There's no reason why we can't be getting this done. All right, still haven't, in, uh, I don't know, I still haven't had an injury to deal with, so that's good. You know what I haven't done? I haven't even checked out our AHL team, Hershey Bears. Uh, ooh, they're, they're not making the playoffs. <laughs> oh, whatever. Um... Yeah, game three on the road. Let's just keep it going, boys. You guys know what you're doing, man. You guys are the better team, the Washington Capitals. You got no problem against the Florida Panthers. Come on now. First period. Oh, they got two. All right, they get the first lead of the series. All right, Peter Mueller. Is it Peter Mueller? I think it's Peter Mueller. Peter Mueller and Ryan Klo. Ovi gets one, though, so the Ovi's on the board in the playoffs, so that's good. Come on now. The game's not even close to being over. Second period. There you go, and we answer back with two. Ovi gets a second of the game from, like, the sharpest of all angles, and Dustin Penner follows up suit from the exact same position. Oh my goodness gracious, 3-2 to two going into the third period. Come on, Washington, you guys got this. I could use a support goal, but I don't know, Braden Holpe seems to be the man, so I have all the confidence in the world in this guy right now. Look at this! Look at this! Braden freaking Holpe, what a beast! Holds them off in the third period, all right? Allows two goals early in the first, then shuts them down for the rest of the game. And another game where a 33 shots against <laughs> only two goals, man. So this guy is way above 900 for save percentage. And yeah, Ovechkin had two goals. So, I mean, this is, uh, they just don't have a goalie, man. There's, there's basically no chance that they're going to have a game where, you know, their goalie steals it for them, where they only allow one goal, maybe two goals, you know? It's not going to happen. May happen one of these games, but now they've got to ha have it happen four games in a row. Nah, nah, nah. This series is over, all right? But they can still drag it out for a few games. So let's win this game right away so we don't have to worry about any getting any injuries in games uh, five, six, or seven, all right? Let's just end this right now, boys. Let's just close it out right now, and let's make a trip back to the second round once again. All right, come on now. Here we go. First period. There you go, you got one, Nicholas Backstrom. So, every one of our uh, first liners have gotten a goal in this first series, so that's good for us, all right? Come on now, keep it going. Second period, there you go, there's another one, Nicholas Backstrom's got two now. All right, we got the two-goal lead, we got the routine going into the third period. Come on, Hopi, you got the routine set, son. You got this. I could use a dagger. Oh, they, they got a power play goal. I could use a support. No! Oh, Gotch gets another power play goal. That's a big major. Oh, but Mike Ribeiro answers back. Come on now, Hopi. Come on now, Hopi. I know there were two power plays. He kills one off. Wow, there it is. All right. Don't worry about it, Hopi. You had two goals against there uh, as well, but it doesn't matter because your offense helped you out that, uh, that series. All right. 
Jesus, a four-game sweep of the Florida Panthers. Let's hope that we avoided any injuries there in game four. Backstrom with two goals. Datsuk with two assists. Hell freaking yeah, son. Hell yeah. All right. Yeah, we didn't have any injuries. Thank God. All right. So we got by that first round. Injury-free. Pretty good, too. So let's go up to the second round. This is going to be a quick video. Damn. We didn't have one game where we didn't score more uh, or less than three goals, man. That's what offense can do for you. Hell yeah. So let's simulate up. Let's see who we have in the second round here. All right, and this is good because all these other teams might be getting injuries now. Uh, AHL, blah, blah, blah. Uh, yeah, continue. Keep going. Look at all this time off our guys get, man. This is good. Uh, oh, the trip to Russia. Yeah, we can send our scout back out. Hang on one second. Forwards. We've pretty much done every category, haven't we? Uh, yeah, we've just done Russia. Oh, man, there's like no four-star uh, no four -star players. Elite, we've done. Sim Liga, we did Sim Liga a little bit, didn't we? Nah, I'll go back to Sim Liga again. Uh, one month. There you go. All right. Game five, game six. Yeah, it could still be another like four days before the second round starts, man. We got this series <laughs> over and done with very quickly. Come on now, simulate up. Taking forever. There you go. Keep going. Jesus. This is good, though, man. Could you imagine if we got, like, uh, a Datsuk injury in Game 5 or something? No. I don't need that. Get the series done and over with as soon as possible. Holy crap. When does the next round start? Should be coming up in, by Tuesday at least. Yeah, there it is. All right. Ooh. Stop simulation. And in the second round, we got Steven Stamkos and the Tampa Bay Lightning. Another divisional opponent, all right? The record's a little bit better. 44, 33, and 5. 44 and 4, uh, 38, basically. All right. So, pretty good. We got back to the same spot that we were last year. All right. Seems to be the same spot that the uh, Washington Capitals get to every year. The second round. But they just can't get by that second round, all right? But is this the year? Is this the year with Braden Holpe with uh, one year of experience now? Two years of experience now. My bad. All right. With Pavel Datsuk playing alongside of Alexander Ovechkin. With uh, Eric Johnson and Jake Gardner as the first line defensive core. With Mike Green gone. Is this the year that the Washington Capitals can finally get by the second round? All right. I mean, in the first round. Oh, well, I'll go to the Western Conference first. Uh, yeah, the Minnesota Wild, first seeded Minnesota Wild, beat the Columbus Blue Jackets, the LA Kings beat the Nashville Predators, Chicago beat St. Louis, and the San Jose Sharks beat the Calgary Flames. They didn't go anywhere. <laughs> and then the Eastern Conference. So, we beat the 8th seeded Florida Panthers, and now we're up against the 7th seeded Tampa Bay Lightning. So, that's why that uh, first in the East is definitely, ho hopefully it's going to help us out here, right? Uh, and look, Tampa Bay upset the 2nd seeded Buffalo Sabres, so bye-bye Ryan Miller, thank God. Uh, Pittsburgh... They uh, beat the Toronto Maple Leafs, and Carolina beats the New York Rangers, all right? So, your final eight, your elite eight, Minnesota versus San Jose, L.A. versus Chicago. That looks like a good series right there. Washington versus Tampa Bay, and Pittsburgh versus Carolina, all right? So, going to the second round, once again, boys, we are 4-0 uh, in the playoffs. I really don't think any changes need to be made, all right? But let me know. Any uh, opinions, anything, just let me know, and I will see you tomorrow in round two.